Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha City Centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup Final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Portugal versus Germany. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's, Let's hope, hope the, the game, game matches, matches the atmosphere. The atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't, I can't wait, wait for this to start. start. Ronaldo Silva. Chance for Ronaldo Silva. The opening goal in the final. And how important could that be as a direction pointer? Well, just look at this again. He's so hard to knock off the ball once he gets going. Of course the defending could be better, but that's a great individual goal. And so Germany gets the ball moving again. Can they find a response here? Leroy Zane. And off target is in the end. And that'll be a goal kick. Portugal will get the throw in. And he read it well, intercepting it. Sorry in Pepe. A time just challenged magnificently. Fine work from Germany to win back possession. They are. Chance for Ronaldo Silva, and there it is! A two-goal cushion now, and just look at these fans! The trophy coming their way, surely! Two-goal now, and back on the way. Cristiano Ronaldo. And Ronaldo Silva has it, but the danger of that is for now. Portugal pushing forward with options available. And the opportunity goes a begging. He decided to hit that with power rather than going for placement. Joshua Kimmich. It's with Gundogan. Thomas Müller. Take it away, he won the ball. They are. Can he take the chance? A goal! And it seems they're truly cruising to victory here. Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box. Big players to attack it, and then what a big play on that one. He just seems to have a great understanding of where to place himself in the box. That's a very good goal. And so it is the first half scoring. So, back in business. Germany's difficulties there for all to see in the first half. How do they respond now? All time tackle. Cristiano Ronaldo, Daddy Devine. Bernardo Silva. Will he find the net? And he's fired it against the post. A goal! An exceptional performance, this. Four to the goal. Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection, and he has so much pace in it. It's a great goal. And this is turning into something of a right. 4-0. Clean challenge. Cristiano Ronaldo. Rudiger. Leroy Zane. It's with Gundogan. Gundogan. 
Thomas Müller. And they get it stuck in defensively. And the referee is quite rightly letting it go. And he's through here. Terrific save. Well, that's a top class save. He read it so well. This isn't good enough. Giving up possession in a dangerous area. Just poor defending all round. My goodness, it's so one-sided. 5-0 in this match. Effective challenge. It's Bernardo Silva. And they've got themselves a bit of time. And the timing was perfect. Ball one. And as a defender, you really have to, to concentrate to the maximum to bar the door as he did then. William Carvalho. Ronaldo, and he's made it a brace for himself. The defender is just unable to stay with him, and he's having a field day. Well, as you can see, he's a dangerous runner with the ball. He has such good balance and pace. That's a top-class goal, isn't it? So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Well, if there weren't any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Joao Phoenix. And now it's all over. We've won this history. Portugal won the World Cup for the first time. One of the good things of Europe and the hardest things of the world. I have to say, Derek, they fully deserved it. They were great today.